Hey guys, um, figured I'd make a video um, doing a journey on uh, trying to get to Cherno. Um, I got quite a bit of ways to go. I uh, figured I'd videotape it, let you guys see. Um, it's in my private server just to show you that it runs smooth and everything works pretty well. Um, let's see, I think I'm facing the wrong way. Um, it run. I mean, so far I still haven't found a vehicle, uh, just a damaged bus, and, uh, needed a lot of repair, and I didn't have a tool kit, um, and all I had was a windshield, so I couldn't really test it, um, hoping that I come across a, another vehicle here soon. Oh, man, I need to see that guy. Um... It's not your typical scary game, sorry, um, but to me it creeps me out, man. The noise, especially when you have headphones on, the noises they make, and uh, that they're like kind of like 20 days later when they run at you and not your typical slow moving zombies. We're moving right along. Um, I don't know. I like it. I, I do. I uh, I like that it's different. Um, you have your jump scares sometimes. Uh, Earlier I got scared pretty bad and kind of made me jump, but not like not like a, a game that's out to make you jump, but I'm wondering if I should just run, because I got a long ways to go. It's just that every, it seems like every time I run though, I something happens and I die, especially when you're playing by yourself, but so the video's not boring, I think I'll uh, take a run for it. It'd be nice if I found a vehicle. Oh, I'm looking out. Now, if that is a glitch, that's one big water bottle. Oh my god. Or is that. F no, it's that big. That's what she said. If you guys would like me to play differently, like at night or in first person or, you know, whatever you guys would like me to do, just let me know. I don't care for either or, just because anyone that's played DayZ at night knows it's extremely hard. Um, not, not that it's easy. I don't know. It's hard to explain. It's just, you can't see nothing. I mean, it's literally pitch black. You can't see a thing. Um... So it's kind of hard to, to, to play and, and be able to figure out things and move around. So I don't prefer it, but I will play it. Um, and in first person, you know, I'm okay if I'm moving slow, but when I'm running, it just gets motion sickness. I can't, I don't know, I can't handle that. It's too much. But uh, again, I can, you know, play that a little bit if you guys would rather see something like that. Those are the ones I hate the most, and I always seem to attract them. Go figure. They just freak me out. Okay, go, go. No. I should have done that. Uh, a couple of tips, I mean, I'm sure anyone knows, but what I usually do is, obviously, if you don't have weapons, if you run through um, houses and stuff, you can lose them. I usually try to choose a house, obviously, with two doors or a barn, um, that way you can just run straight through and it slows them down and get away, or I get in an area like this where they don't spawn, and uh, I try to take them out, that way I'm not being chased the whole time, but it's a bad idea because then when you stop running usually you shake a lot, so it's... man that's awful.
not a good idea. There we go. Yeah, see, now that way I can not have to worry about them and other ones coming at me. It's still a ways. The thing I like too, um, that it seems like the server uh, goes along with the time that you're in, like it will slowly start getting dark, and, uh, you know, start getting nighttime. And it's not like just a continue, or I mean a constant switch, it just get darker and darker until it's pitch black. I wish more games, oh, like MMOs, like, uh, would do that and not just, um, switch from night to day. They would kind of go with the time, but I guess, I don't know, I guess it's nice, too, because if you like playing at night, but you can't play at night, um, in real life, you know, you'd still be able to play the game at night. Oh, I did, I found a, I forgot to tell you guys, I found a uh, helicopter, too. I don't remember where that's at. I, I should have, actually, I think it was in uh, Electro, and, um, God damn it. It was in Electro, and uh, it was pretty damaged, though. Uh, it didn't have fuel, either. Whoa! Okay, I didn't see that guy. Okay, good, I'm not bleeding. Yeah, it, it's been a while, like I said, since I've played too. I didn't know you can get a, infected. I don't think you change. I think it just slowly kills you. Um, man, they are all about this area. God, they sound so creepy. I guess I'm about to find out. I don't see uh, another option except for run into water, but I hate doing that. It slows down. Ooh, is it? What is this? I got to eat. And... Please shut. Please shut. No, no. Oh, God. Okay. Actually, I should keep this gun out because I think... Here a second. Oh, Another thing that I like, well, I mean, I don't like, but it's nice when you're, especially when you're playing by yourself and you get surrounded. I've noticed in uh, 
couple of towns, like when you get into a house and you back up into a corner, um, eventually they'll turn away. But uh, it doesn't always work. It's like a selected few. Really wish I had. Oh, I gotta eat. That's right. No, go back. I always forget to do that. Covering. Stay on the road, but ah, see, like this, I'll play first person. It doesn't move as much, so I'm all right. I really hope I run into a vehicle. Uh, that would be a whole lot nicer. If one of those guys ever got up, man, I'd quit playing. That would scare the crap out of me. I, I just, every time I get near them, I always freak out that they're going to move. Just the one time I wouldn't expect it. This were to ever happen in real life, I don't know what I would do. Cause man, you'd be honestly, you'd be running a lot, and I just don't think uh, anyone would be able to do it. Yeah, you find shelter, but you're always going to have to move. So now I'm trying not to get seen. I keep getting too many on me. I just really don't feel like dying. You'll know what I'm going through. others. Dang, it looks like it's... Yeah, it's... Oh, it's in a lot better shape, though, than the uh, other vehicles I've been finding. Here. 
Hallo. Jetzt hat er gerade voll alles da. You could um, mark spots on your map. I mean, maybe you can. I just don't know how. But I'm gonna try and remember this car's great as line is the road. I'll try to come back for it. Definitely use it. Actually, I could probably get in it and see how much um, gas it has too. Uh, it's got a little bit. That's what I like about this. I mean, it is annoying. Whoa. It is, uh, annoying. But it's also really cool that, uh, you know, you gotta, like, actually scavenge for vehicles and, and fix them. You can't just. I mean, some you can, but you, you can't just jump in them and go. Like, at times like now, I wish that it was drivable, but at the same time, it's a neat idea that they're all damaged. Barnes have good stuff, so I'm gonna try and work my way over there. Whoa. And watch him watch him see me. This is the kind of Oh my god. Oh man, I'm I'm freaking out now. Nope. <laughs> if he if he turns and comes at me. Okay. You may hear some screaming. Sorry if you guys can't hear me good either. Um, now I've been coming down with something. I'm trying to I'm trying to get rid of it, but it just it's not working. It seems like every day it's getting worse. Okay, I'm Run for that barn, though. I really wish I had an axe or, or a bow. Take them out quietly. Actually, I've never used the. I'm assuming it's quiet. Um, it would work, but I've never actually used one. I've always just got an axe and a handgun, like I was saying. I switch it to simple. Yeah, to switch your, um, I don't know if anyone needs to know, but, uh, switch from semi to, to fully, and, um, if you have, like, flares and stuff like that, you just hit F, and, uh, it will switch. I've done that multiple times where I don't know I'm on my flares and I go to attack and it's my I throw a flare. Sweet. I can You've got to be kidding me. I'm not saying that. Well Whoa. At least I got the barn I was talking about where you can uh run through it pretty much and slow them down and either take them out or just kind of trap them all in there and get away. Yeah, these are like the best because you just get in here and try to get them all coming from one side and go the other way because they, uh, they'll walk as you can see once they get in here. Not, um, I don't know about it in the standalone. I don't think it works. I think they still run. And uh the standalone, so you can't really get away with it in that game, but usually stuff. Yeah, there we go, see. Yeah, usually they have something.
No, oh, it is a... No, it's not. I thought it was a uh, different style of barn. Maybe that's what I was... Oh, no, that's it. That's what I thought it was. That was really stupid of me. Can you ride? That would... Oh, my God, that's going to make my day. I have to ride that. Oh, uh, that's going to be funny. If it gets me away from him, I guess that's all that counts. Hard to drive. Okay. You would not believe how hard this is to uh, steer. Hey, I'm not on the road. So fun. I can blow my horn. Oh. <laughs> uh, oh. That is awesome. I wonder if that attracts me. Wow. Maybe I'd rather have this than a car. Man, you really move. Forty-five miles an hour. We're almost there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. over here and just call it quits. Um, sorry, I don't mean to do that. I will uh, continue from this spot. I think, yeah, this runs into it too. Let's see if... I'm afraid to leave it because I don't know. If... It used to say on the uh, older version, you, you, you click on it and it would say save vehicle. saying it. I'm hoping that it saves it. 
Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to call it quits. Um, I'll start another video from here for you guys. Um, again, please leave a like and uh, subscribe if you like. I'll try to do better and more videos. Again, I'm new at this, so um, yeah, I'm just starting out. And uh, I really appreciate the uh, help with you guys. So uh, again, until next time, I'll see you guys later.